Good morning, bestie girl. Good morning, guys. Welcome to today's vlog. I am up in Salt Lake. I'm at Lauren's house. I got in yesterday. We actually went to a football game, and it was my first college football game. It was really fun. But they have this weird... Well, I support the new policy because it's for safety. But they need to make it more clear because we didn't know until we got there. Anyways, they don't allow bags of any kind into the stadium. So when you get up there, they give you like these plastic bags and you have to like put all of your stuff in there. But then you just have to like Roll leave your bag. bag or go and put it like back in your car. And we walked like a mile to get there. So we ended up just like hiding our purses behind this pole. The moment of truth. they were like totally empty so we we're like okay hey, hopefully they don't get stolen but like if someone finds it what are they gonna do with like an empty purse luckily no one stole them but we had sleepover last night and lauren actually has a guest room but <laughs> i really hate sleeping by myself <laughs> so last night she was like oh are you excited for your room or do you want to just sleep with me you'll probably just end up sleeping with me and i was like yeah i was just waiting for you to offer <laughs> so we had a best secret sleepover we actually didn't go to bed till like 3 a.m and Lauren actually stays up late like every night so that's Lauren's normal bedtime but for me that was so dang late so right now we're actually gonna go over it's like 2 30 and we're like we've just been hanging out but our favorite thing is to just watch shows <laughs> so now we're actually about to go see my new house I'm so excited all right we're setting an official timer to see Oh wait, that's a timer for two minutes wait, what I am I trying to do stopwatch I don't know you guys can't even house. see my screen that we'll good. look it up we're gonna see how far. So far, it's four seconds. All right, we gotta check the timer. There was an interference. Two. Wait, what is happening? Oh, that was only 10 minutes. With two pullovers. Yeah, 10 minutes and 22 seconds. And we had to like pull over twice because there was like a police like person escorting some people. I'm sorry. Guys, this is so exciting. Oh my gosh. Guys, it looks amazing. It's painted. The wood floors are in. We did the light wood. It's all covered so you guys can't really see it and the lighting kind of makes it it's like lighter than it looks my cabinets fun fact about our current house they actually installed the wrong cabinets we probably talked about that in a vlog but in the video where we showed ourselves like at the design center designing the house we're like oh so we picked out like this carpet and these cabinets and blah 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 and then you can see the cabinets and then i guess the girl wrote it down wrong i don't even know but they installed the wrong ones and i was like what the heck but they're, they were so similar so i was like wait what the freak so then we emailed and like she pulled up the sheet where you sign like oh i i reviewed this and i picked this and this but obviously i'm not going to know the difference between like the two names of the cabinets they were like oh yeah sorry like you signed it on the thing so we can't change it. And I was like, well, I have a video of me saying like, oh, I picked out this one. And they were like, oh, too bad. So lucky for me, they installed the right cabinets at this house. I showed a picture on Instagram of the cabinets being installed. And I literally had like hundreds of messages about how the kitchen looks really similar to our kitchen now. People were like, wait, I'm so confused. I posted a little bit about it on Instagram, just like answering the question about it. So basically the model home is this same floor plan, but it's flipped. So when you go into the model home, the floor plan is like backwards and so we like didn't realize at all that it looked similar to like the setup of our current kitchen because when it's flipped like you just don't really think of it as like being like that and we actually didn't know that they were gonna flip it until we had already like started going with the process of everything but i don't mind that it's flipped but anyways the kitchen layout is really similar but i actually love our kitchen we have like the pantry here our oven and stuff is actually like over there there's a lot more space right here like the actual island is bigger the fridge is in a little bit of a different spot this entire layout is literally the same as our current layout but i love it so i'm super super excited it is cute I do too. It'll be good. Okay, how cute. I got some new lights. So these are ones that like come with the house if you don't upgrade anything. And so I ordered some new ones that are really, really cute. Yeah, little did we know that this was gonna look exactly like our current house. I'm excited because I don't have to get a new couch. We're gonna have a mirror over here. I love our layout. I love how it's just open. We can watch TV from the kitchen. Was that my stove? Look how cute. This looks so amazing. I'm so excited to just move in right now. I feel like they could, if they tried really hard, they could probably finish it in a week. <laughs> this is the bedroom. So we have the shiplap on the walls. I want to see the bathroom. Last time we were here, it looked like so crazy. Oh, it looks really good. We got the tub. 
the shower oh the shower looks so much bigger than it did when it was just framed out this is my side it has a little makeup vanity and then this is the closet that's nice they put wood in here yeah this is our light tile and then the grout is going to be light too it's not filled in yet going up the stairs oh another thing people were literally messaging me like shocked that there's no railing on the stairs they were like oh my gosh that's so unsafe they're gonna put the railing in and they just haven't done it yet <laughs> It's not even legal to not have one, so don't worry guys. It's gonna be black. It will be installed soon. Where's my room? Um, I think this is your room. This will be our guest room. Looks amazing. So we have an extra bed to put in here. And then I think I'll put a dresser on that wall. These look so much bigger now that they like, look like rooms, you know? Yeah. I know, when it's framed, it seems like everything is so yeah. small. I feel like the wood is growing on me. No, it's so cute, I think. It's not I bad. It's not dark at all. This will be Parker's little man cave area. So I think I'll put the couch right here. I couldn't decide where to put the couch and where to put the TV. The pink one that I have in my That's office. That's Parker's man cave couch. That's Parker's man cave couch. <laughs> he said he wants to get a new one, but for now, we're just gonna put that one there for a little bit. So I'll have the big white fluffy rug in here, the one that's in our current living room, cause it will fit. And then I think I'll have the couch here. And then the TV stand we currently have in our living room will go right here. And then we don't have any plans for this room. It'll probably just stay empty for a while. But this is the cutest one. This oh, you can have it. It's cute cause it has the little like these things. We have this closet. Oh, cool, my blankets can go in here. This will be a baby's room. The second stop on our bestie girl day of fun is our favorite pizza place. Yay. Here's our pizzas. Mine has a bunch of veggies on it and vegan cheese. Lauren always gets margarita pizza and you dip it in the balsamic, mm -hmm. fancy. We also got some garlic knots. Next step on our bestie girl adventure day is going to this place called Little Codwood Canyon. I'm working on my new fall preset pack, as you guys know, and I need some pictures. There are no fall leaves down where I live. Like, everything fall is up here, so hopefully we can get a good picture. This isn't where I typically would, like, take photos because I just don't really take a lot of pictures with trees. Also, I was thinking about earlier when I was talking about how they made us use the clear plastic bags at the game last night, and I didn't even finish what I was saying. It was weird because they wouldn't let you bring your bag in. You had to put everything in a clear plastic bag for like security safety reasons, but then they also didn't have metal detectors, right? No, they didn't. Like we could have like, I had like a huge jacket on. We could have like put my backpack on like full of bad stuff. And yeah. Just like walked through. Yeah. Like so they just like couldn't it, see a bag. It was weird. Like it was just a weird safety precaution for them to take to not take those other ones too. Like we also have a metal detector and like this and this. And one of our friends had a blanket and the guy just like didn't even check her blanket. Like he was just like, oh, yep, go in. So she totally could have like had a person there or something. Anyways, this is also where I took my engagement pictures. That's when Parker and I met JC. That was the first time that we ever met her, which was like three years ago. So that's here? fun. I don't think she was living here. I think she was just visiting here for some reason. All right, we just drove up and back down the entire canyon looking for somewhere to pull off and take pictures. I'm wearing the wrong shoes for this. I'm gonna fall. I'm trying to use a tree as my tripod. Are you guys okay? <laughs> Is you okay? Is you good? Because I want to know. Okay. Let's we'll see. Up. It might have been a fail. You guys didn't get a C, but we need more leaves. We're gonna have to redo it. Lauren is Bessie girl, cameraman, assistant, I do it holder all. of stuff, all in one. All right, the tree tripod didn't work. We're back at Lauren's apartment. Being here is like staying at Monica Geller's house. No, it's not. <laughs> because you can't dramatic. make any messes. I'm so scared. <laughs> you are being dramatic. No, it's true. It's so scary. I rinse my dishes right after I eat. I don't drop anything. <laughs> so good at being a vlogger friend. She just turned down the radio when I got out the camera. Welcome to Aspen and Lauren's day of fun number two. We had another sleepover last night. Still slept in Lauren's bed because I hate sleeping alone. But Lauren got us foot massages. And if you guys know us, you know that is our favorite thing is to go and get a foot massage. Where have we gotten them? Is it just Japan? Is that the only time? No, I feel like that can't be it. We've gotten them some other time. 
don't remember when, but anytime we're walking around like a city or something like New York or when we went to Japan, sometimes you just need a foot massage and they're the best. So Lauren got us some and I'm super, super excited. And then we're actually going to this restaurant in Salt Lake that Lauren says is really good. And I think we're meeting either my mom and Avery or my mom and Avery and Cooper or just Avery and Cooper or maybe just Avery, I don't know, but somebody's supposed to be meeting us for lunch, so. It'll be so fun and I'm so excited for our foot massages. Hopefully this place is good, we have never been. We can't go wrong with a foot massage. One hour later. It was so fun. That was nice, it wasn't just your feet. They did like your like shoulders like your and your hands. arms. It was nice, we recommend. So the worst part of Salt Lake is finding parking places just like the worst part of any city we just drove around probably for 10 solid minutes looking for parking and then we pulled up to the restaurant that we're going to again and we noticed there's a parking garage right next, <laughs> right next door literally right next door did you see it and i just didn't see I it don't, i think i saw it but i thought it was just like the thing of the restaurant uh, i don't know but also apparently on sundays it is free to park well, we, think. <laughs> we think we don't know we'll see when we leave but see if i get a ticket That looks so good. It all looks so good. So Lauren's been telling me that these pita fries are like the best thing I'm ever gonna eat, so. Oh wait, this is so good. <laughs> is it better than Zaytava? This is like a totally different thing. This is so good. We all recommend Spitz in Salt Lake. Weird name, really good food. Alright guys, I'm at my mom's house. I think I'm gonna end the vlog here So I really hope you guys enjoyed watching Also go and check out the new video that I just uploaded to my main channel I'm actually about to finish it and get it up, but by the time you guys see this it will be up already I did wearing $5 runway outfits for the week. So make sure you guys check that out The link is down below and I'll see you guys in the next vlog. Bye guys. Say bye Evie. Say bye